Hello guys, I'm Timothy Earl from Earl Sports Bets and Picks and Parlays, and welcome back to another episode of Balling Out with Tim Earl. We get some NBA playoffs. We get some game fives, some closeout games maybe. Um, one of them is guaranteed not to be, but we got a bunch of 3-1 series. We'll be talking Knicks, uh, Cavs, Lakers, Grizzlies, Heat, and Bucks, and the Warriors and the Kings. So lots of games to talk about. Before we jump into it, if you guys are interested, uh, one week pass for the NBA and, and and the MLB. Both of those are linked in the description below, picksandparlays.net forward slash Tim, if you guys are interested in jumping on those. Let's jump into it. We'll start off with the first game, the Knicks and the Cavs. The Cavs are five and a half point favorites. 202 and a half is the total. And one thing I've noticed throughout the series, um, I was high on the Cavs coming into this one. Uh, they look pathetic. Uh, I'm taking the Knicks. I, I think they close it out tomorrow. Um, they're five and a half point dogs. I'll take the points. Uh, I, I'm fine with that. Um, I would sprinkle the money line too. I wouldn't mind that. That's probably around plus 180, plus 190. I know the Cavs are a really good home team, but this team has looked pathetic. Um, they've lost three games. They're down three to one in the series, losing by nine 20. And they lost by four in the first game, but I think this is a close enough game. Go ahead, give me the Knicks plus the five and a half to start it off. Lakers and the Grizzlies uh, is the next one. Grizzlies four point favorites with a total of two twenty two, and the Lakers are up three to one in this series. Um, I did not expect the Lakers to be the team that they are right now, um, but when it comes to it, I don't think they close out quite yet. I'm taking the Grizzlies minus the four. Um, I think Grizzlies come back in this game. I think it's a double-digit kind of a blowout. I don't want to say blowout win. I think it's a double-digit win for the Grizzlies, and then the Lakers probably finish it off in game six. Um, I, I just don't see them closing it out, out on the road in Memphis when Memphis is – what actually, Memphis, Memphis was the best home team in the NBA uh, during the regular season. I just don't see them closing it out there. I'll take the Grizzlies minus the four to extend the series. Speaking about series, uh, the Bucs are in trouble. They're 11 point favorites in this one. 219 and a half is the total. Um, They're down three to one in the series. Not really what we expected to see. Although if you wanted to go and bet it, the Bucs are plus 120 still to win the series. Um, Okay, then Uh, I will be taking the heat. Uh, I'll be taking them plus the 11. I think it's too many points. Um, I'm not laying points on the on the uh, Bucks right now. I know they're at home, and uh, they had their one win at home. I I don't foresee this one being a blowout. Uh, I could I could look at the under in this game, two nineteen and a half. I could look towards the under, and the under would kind of point in the favor of the Heat. Uh, I'll take the Heat plus the eleven uh, in this one. Final game of the day, and you probably know where exactly I'm going. The Warriors are one and a half point favorites. With a total of 235. And um, I've been on them all series. So I'm not stopping now. I'm on the Kings. I'm doing it until, you know, Warriors prove me wrong. That's what I'm doing. Prove me wrong. Uh, they are 11 and 32 on the road this year. They barely won at home in game four. Kings could have won that game. This one could be three to one and done in five. I still think this is a game. This is a series that's probably going seven, where the home team wins every single game. De'Aaron Fox will be in for the Kings. I know they there was many reports saying that he was going to be out game five with the. No, he's going to be in. You better believe it. And uh, Kings will take care of business. We'll grab him on the money line plus the one hundred. Those are your four free picks. Once again, if you guys are interested in the MLB plays and the NBA uh, week pass, picksandparlays.net forward slash Tim. Recap, we're grabbing the Knicks, Grizzlies, the Heat, and the Kings for tomorrow's playoff games. I want to thank everybody for watching. Until next time, let's make some money. Let's cash some bets in the NBA playoffs. Good luck, guys.